Welcome to our small marginal gain video. So this is the stalk turn, which is attacking those hips, trying to get those hips a bit more mobile. So the first setup is you've got, I've got a gym bar, you can use a driver if you want. So arms nice and relaxed out. So you're looking, you're trying to create like a triangle with your arms and your shoulders. So the first one, the feet are just over hip width apart. If you do struggle with this one, then bring your feet in. The narrower the feet, the easier it is. So you're trying to keep the top half nice and still and just rotate the bottom half. Try and keep that top half nice and still. Don't need to go too fast or anything, just nice and steady. And do 12. So one forward accounts as one, two, three, and up to 12. Next one is same position. Then put one foot behind the kneecap. You'll probably choose your more dominant leg to begin with. Same idea, this one's a lot harder. So you get the balance first. Brace the top and then rotate. Make sure you use the hip to rotate and not just chuck the knee everywhere. So that's 12 again. Do the same with the other foot. So one foot will be stronger than the other. One leg, sorry, will be stronger than the other. Just rotate. So this one's a bit more wobbly. So take your time, get yourself balanced and go. And then go back to the first one, which will then suddenly feel a lot easier. If you're feeling any pain in your lower back, then stop. But that's a simple drill you can do in a couple of minutes, which will just give you that feel of what you're trying to do with the hips, separating them from the top half. That would be a great small marginal gain to add to that massive improvement of feeling those hips separate from that top half.